Each airport has characteristics that can lead pilots to make errors that result in wrong surface operations, runway incursions, or other surface events. Let's take a look at issues you might encounter at Atlantic City International Airport from the flight deck. Atlantic City International is a medium-sized multi-use airport located approximately seven miles northwest of Atlantic City, New Jersey. It has Class Charlie airspace associated with it. Pilots unfamiliar with operating in this environment need to review airspace requirements during pre-flight planning. The runway configuration consists of two intersecting runways labeled runway 422 and the primary runway 1331. All facilities and services are located south of the runway complex. A straightforward taxiway system, including full-length parallel taxiways on both runways, provides easy access. While the traffic is primarily general and business aircraft, air carrier and military aircraft also do utilize the airport. The Air National Guard and the Coast Guard have a permanent presence on the field. Surrounding airport flight schools utilize ACY for towered airport training too. Many types of aircraft utilize the airport, from primary trainers through heavy transport category aircraft, as well as a robust helicopter community. The FAA's William J. Hughes Technical Center is also located at the airport. The Tech Center conducts a variety of test program flights and UAS testing is becoming very prevalent. This mix of pilot experience and aircraft capability make Atlantic City an interesting place to fly. During pre-flight planning, please note that land and hold short operations are utilized at ACY. While it is always the pilot in command's prerogative to reject such a clearance, the place to do so is not on short final. Inform the tower, allowing plenty of time for the controller to devise a different plan. During that same pre-flight planning, also note that there is military arresting gear located 1,600 feet from either approach end of runway 1331. Pilots, please note, if you plan on taxiing back for another practice approach, advise ATC before you begin taxiing back to the runway to ensure safe and efficient operations on the ground. Full-length parallel taxiways are a nationally recognized risk factor for wrong surface landings. This situation occurs primarily on runway 1331 and taxiway Bravo at ACY. Pilots can avoid this situation by positively identifying the runway of intended landing as soon as possible. And remember that aircraft land and take off on white surface markings and taxi on yellow. Hotspot number one is located at the intersections of taxiways Alpha and Bravo and both runways. Pilots cleared to taxi via Alpha Bravo or taxi via Bravo Alpha have missed the turn and the hold short markings and incurred a runway. To avoid making this type of mistake, have a complete understanding of taxi clearance, including route, turns, and hold short instructions before moving the aircraft. And please use extra vigilance, watching for surface markings, above ground signage, and lighting outside the aircraft. There are also a couple other issues, not listed as hotspots, of which pilots need to be aware. The Air National Guard is a major presence on the field. There are several areas restricted to military aircraft only. There are two ramp areas, one located at the approach end of runway 4, and the other is found south of Taxiway Bravo on Taxiway Charlie. There are two arm d arm locations, each at the approach ends of runway 1331. All these restricted areas are clearly annotated on the airport diagram. However, if you are ever in doubt or don't understand any clearance or air traffic control instruction, the easiest answer is to ask the tower. Remember, they are there to help you. The last area concerns a nationally identified risk when ramp areas have direct taxiway access to runways. At ACY, this can be found on runway 1331 at taxiway Kilo toward Bravo, at taxiway Juliet and Lima toward Hotel and also to a lesser extent on runway 422 at taxiway Delta and Gulf toward Alpha. Use extra awareness outside the aircraft while taxiing. We hope this short video will help pilots make better decisions and along with the air traffic control tower, make your flight safe and efficient. Now you're better prepared for your trip to Atlantic City International Airport. It's always better to know before you go.